see friends there may be 7 billion people can 7 people be free one person be free if such a person you can find that freedom in himself it will be like it will suddenly start creating waves because nobody can touch him think for yourself sit down are you affected like last yesterday i finished that class with this statement go and sit down think for yourself do you still feel that you must do something to be happy you must achieve something to be happy sit down how krishna says in bhagavad gita partha nasti me kartavyam trishu loke su kinchana nana baptam abaptavyam vartayeva cha karmana naiva tasya krutena artha akrutaneya kaschana the wise person the person who is happy contented settled literally reveling within himself atma rati atma krida reveling in himself playing with the universe such a person think of it such a person there is nothing to be done in life naiva tasya krutena artha akrutena there is it difference makes no difference if he does something or doesn't do something One lovely verse comes somewhere in the tradition. Jnanam brutena tuptasya Kruta krutyasya yoginaha Naivasti ginchit kartabhyam Asti chet nasa brahmavit Amazing verse. Jnanam brutena tuptasya The man who is contented, satisfied with this nectar of knowledge, wisdom of himself Atma jnana, knowledge and wisdom of himself Naivasti kinchit kartabhyam. Kinchit kartabhyam nasti. Kartabhyam means what? Kartum yogyam. There is no such thing to be done by doing which I will be happy or by not doing which I shall be happy. No conditions apply. Naivasti kinchit kartabhyam. There is no such thing to be done or not to be done. To be achieved or not to be achieved. To be accepted or to be rejected. There is no such thing. I, my happiness is unconditional. I am the happiness. Am I the only one? The whole universe is like that. Naivasti kinchit kartabhyam. There is no such thing by doing which or by not doing which I shall be happy or unhappy. There is no such stuff. There is no such by doing which I shall be happy or unhappy. No. I am the fulfillment, happiness itself. Asti chet. In case somebody says, no, no, I must do something, then only I'll be happy. Or I should not do this, then only I'll be, I'll be happy. If you, even in a slightest hint of a condition you put in your head, Nasa Brahmavit, you don't know the truth. There is no such thing. My being myself, and friends, in this, my being, myself, includes the whole universe. If you are educated, everybody is not. You are rich, everybody is not rich. You are poor, everybody is not poor. You cannot escape the comparison and the contrast. If the education by which I am defining myself, please see that. If the education by which I am defining myself, Somebody shall be superior to me, somebody shall be inferior to me. Because I am not the last word in education. Right or wrong? If I am defining myself with the wealth, that somebody will be wealthier, somebody will be poorer, you cannot escape this comparison and the contrast. Therefore, the sense of pride, arrogance or helplessness, inferiority. You can't escape. But if you define yourself as you are, ultimate self-definition, the entire mankind comes under that. Nobody is superior, nobody is inferior. Nobody is more divine, nobody is less divine. You understand? In case you have an idea, sit down. Are you happy with yourself? yourself? You stand, sit down for yourself. Is there a whisper in your head? If only 
I can go to Badrinath, Himalayas, then only I will be happy. If only I can have 200, you know, cars, I'm happy. Or if I can get away from the city and live inside a forest, then only I'll be happy. No preconditions. No preconditions. What does it mean is, even this little mental activity, by doing which and by not doing which, even a whisper of a condition doesn't exist. Absolute fulfillment. Long before, friends, we are conditioned to have something to feel happy or fulfilled. You are already who you 